Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'll be showing you how to on any iPhone or other iOS device including iPods and so on, how to basically um, fix the issue where you have forgotten your your content and privacy restrictions password and of course maybe you have a website that has been blocked and of course you are seeing that warning that you cannot access the website and of course if you hit on allow access it's asking for a password and you have forgotten the password um, other things that might happen is that you might not be seeing all of your apps as they're in restricted mode where apps are restricted or maybe it's that you're trying to view listen audio and it's not allowing explicit content or of course um, you are watching a video and it's locked based on the parental guidance that has been set you set it for your kids but then no you're ready to use the device and you have forgotten the password and cannot uh, remember it all right so i'm going to show you what to do in those cases i'll show you what some of the errors look like on screen in some of the cases but i can't show you all of them but you do get the idea all right so in case you have forgotten the um, password do this so go to settings of course, next you're going to go down to screen time, which is right here. Go down top on screen time. And of course, if you remember, um, if you were the one who set it up, you most likely went into content and privacy restrictions and you had set some restrictions. Now, of course, the passcode here is right here and it will govern all settings in this area. You'd have to input this password. So go ahead and click on change screen time passcode and you'll see these two options down here. What you want to do from here guys you'll have the option to change screen time passcode or of course turn off the um the screen time passcode in this case i'm going to pretend that you forgot the password so you want to turn it off go ahead and hit turn off screen time passcode it will ask you for the passcode but of course you have forgotten it and of course here's the part or the key to um, recovering the password go ahead and hit on forgot passcode it's right there in blue top and of course it will bring you here now right here seeing that you have forgotten the passcode all you gotta do is go ahead and input your apple id in other words that would be the email that you use to create your apple id and of course you're going to enter your apple id passcode once you put in both your apple id and apple id passcode it will remove the um requirement for needing the for needing the password and then you can hit ok once you're finished this is the same apple id that's associated with your account as seen here so let me just show you what i mean um, on every device in order to download stuff from um from the app store and also to use your apple devices you have to associate the apple id due to be this apple id right here so if you're using your phone you should know your apple id so that's the apple id that you should use to log in it was um asked for during setup as a secondary measure in case you forgot your password so if you do that guys as i just showed you on the um the screen time option here once the password is removed you're gonna come in here and let's say for example it should be on yours will not ask you for any passcodes once you have removed it with your apple id you will then go into content and restriction which is in here and of course let's say it was something regarding uh, music that was stopping you um, you can remove it from music if it was a video you can um, turn it off and of course if it was for movies you can set that to allow all movies and if it was tv show you can allow it to um, allow all tv show books you can set it to a higher rating or of course you can go through if it was something like website you can set it to unrestricted access um, an easier way to fix this issue is um, just turn the entire thing off so as soon as the passcode is removed what you can do to save time in case you do not know what's blocking you you can just simply go ahead and turn off restriction or turn off the content and privacy restriction and go back and that will disable any restrictions so once you do that guys you'll be able to browse as normal or do anything that you would normally do including watch any type of video visit any website search for anything without restriction all right guys um if this was useful go ahead and give us a thumbs up ricardo garden as usual from block tech tips same bye until next time bye